of September. Amen. Yes. Praise God. Amen. Uh, Pastors, we want to welcome you to New Beginnings Church of the Big Ben. Amen. Uh -huh. A church you can call home where we honor God, we love families, we serve others, and we pursue excellence. And we have a passion for God and we have a passion for souls. Amen. So, NBC family, we want to welcome you, all our visitors, and all of you that are joining us by audio and video. Amen. We want to welcome you. So prepare yourselves to receive what God has for you. And he's got Amen. something for you. Don't they ever say, well, you know, he always forgets about me. No? no, you stop saying that. Amen. You stop saying, hey, God loves me and God wants to bless me. He's already blessed me. You Amen. just got to claim all this. Amen. And we're yeah. going to be talking in a few minutes uh, before I get too far, too ahead of myself. We're going to be talking about praising him. Amen. And all of us can do this. Amen. God's got great plans for you and none of them include your feet. So let's remember this. He's not finished with you yet. Amen. So yeah. don't exclude yourself. Include yourself. Yes. Involve yourselves. Commit, submit, and serve. Amen. That's what he wants us to do. Yes. Amen. Stop feeling sorry for yourself. Get up. You know, all of us can fall. But yeah. the thing is, are you going to stay down or are yeah. you going to get up? It's time for us to get up. And, mm -hmm. and, and God says, okay, now, here I am, Lord, send me. And he says, good, I, I want you to go. And he's got a plan for you. He's got a mission for you. Yeah. And you got to go and fulfill what he called you to do. Remember, I've said this many times. He put you here to win. He didn't put you here to lose. If you're losing, it's because you're not in tune with him. You got to get right with him. Amen. You got to get right with him and pursue what he wants you to do. Big or small does not matter. What matters is, are you serving him? Yes. Amen. Are you serving him? That's the main thing, Amen. God, Jesus said, and in, in, uh, in Matthew says, Jesus came to serve, not to be served, Amen. So we got to get that attitude. We're to be imitators of Him, not imitators of the world, amen. not imitators of people, but imitators of God, Amen. And be Christ-like. Remember, a full with a part-time Christian is no match to a full-time devil. And he's going to come at you with everything he's got. Yeah, and in these yeah. last days, it's going to get worse and worse and worse. And you know, you're going to feel bad. And you're going to say, man, I can't handle this. Mm. Well, you can't handle it because you're not in tune with, yeah. with him. You know, you got to get in tune with him yeah. and say, well, hey, greater is he that sent me than he that sent the world. Yeah. God's yeah. not giving you a spirit of fear, but a power oh, and a love and a sound mind. Sound. You know, hey, and you got to step out in faith. Yeah. Amen. You got to step out in faith. Well, how does that scripture go? It says, we walk by faith and not by sight. Amen. If you're not full of faith, you're full of fear. Yep. And fear is going to stop you. Yes, it will. Amen. Fear is going to stop you. All right. So you got to get all that out. Fill yourself with the word and all that fear is going to leave. Amen. Amen. So anyway, let's grab our sword, soldier, God, yes. and let's make this declaration together. Amen. Yeah. Here we go. This is my body. I am what it says I am. I have what it says I have. I can do what it says I can do. Today, I'll be taught the word of God. I boldly confess. My mind is alert. My spirit is accepted. And I'll never be the same. In Jesus' name, amen. You better believe your mind is awake. You better believe your mind is active because that's the battlefield. Yes, it is. Amen. Whatever is there, you know, if you're not renewing your mind to the things of God, you're going to fall back. And you don't want to fall back. You want to press on with the things of God. Amen. So renew your mind as often as needed. Amen. Yes. Now, I didn't say once a week or yes. once a month or once a year, but often, mm -hmm. daily. Amen. Praise God. I just wanted to thank our praise team because you know what? We had a great praise and worship service. Yes. And you, you missed it, but I, I've got a couple of songs that they sang, and I want to read them to you. And it won't be long. It won't take long. Amen. We want, we're going to be talking about praising Him. And we have to be careful. The Bible tells us death and life are in the power of the tongue. Death and life are in the words that you speak. Amen. So what words are you speaking? Yeah, Listen yeah. to these. It, 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 very short, but strong. It says, yeah. I am blessed. I am blessed. Every day I, that I live, I am I blessed, 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 and blessed. When I wake up in the morning till I'm... Till, till I uh, lay my head to rest, yeah. I am I blessed. Am you need to write that down and, and, and confess it every day. Amen. Man, because if you're not confessing the word, you're confessing what the world says. And we don't have to be confessing negative things because you know what? Yeah. Here's the thing. The Bible tells us 
you can have what you say. That's it. That's it. Amen. And you're going to have what you say. Mm. Well, you say, well, I'll just say it to somebody else. It's mm. for them. No, it's for you. Mm. You've got this little garden that you've planted, you know, mm -hmm. and words are seed. Oh, and you're yeah. sowing these seeds. Mm. And you know what seeds are? Seeds are carriers. Yes, they They're are. carriers of life or death. Or death. Right. Amen. What are you sowing? Mm. Right. They're carriers. And you know what? These seeds seeds grow i don't care you, put, yes, you know a, a seed itself ain't going nothing going to happen you can just let it sit there ain't nothing going to happen but you sow and you plant it yeah. and you put it in the right soil mm -hmm. and you water it and guess what it's going to grow Amen. i don't care where it falls you know the <laughs> birds drop seeds everywhere you know yes. <laughs> and when it rains it gets watered and guess what you got plants or weeds or things growing in all kinds of weird places yes. but you know what they bloom yes, because God created them mm -hmm. to do this amen mm -hmm. and he's created us and we're gonna bloom for him mm -hmm. amen so amen. speak the right things I am blessed 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 yes. instead of saying I mean that I'm no I'm no good I'm not good enough I'm not qualified mm -hmm. I can't do this I can't right, I can't yeah. stop saying those things yes amen. I, I said it again you know he put he put us here to win Yes, and, and to com complete what he wants us to do, not yes. not to lose. Amen. That's it. The world and people will disqualify you quickly. Remember, he's called. He's he's, he's qualified to call. Amen. He don't call the qualified. He's qualified to call. Yes. Amen. And he's called you. Nobody yes. ever told you. Now you know. You've now been you know. called, <laughs> and you've been sent. Mm -hmm. Amen. So let's get it right with him. Here's another one we we, we, we studied about what we sang a few minutes ago. It says, With we say, I will bless thee, O Lord, I will bless thee, O Lord. With the heart of thanksgiving, I will bless thee, O Lord. It says, with my hands lifted up and my mouth filled with praise. Amen. I will bless thee, O Lord. Man, that, that is awesome. Amen. Mm -hmm. So it blesses me. I don't know about you, but you know what? God wants to hear from us. Yes. He put us here. He put us here. He created us for us to bless Him. Amen. Yes, but we're going around blessing other things. Amen. Mm -hmm. Come on. Don't shut me down because I'm preaching good now. <laughs> Here's the thing is, praise is a weapon. Yes, it is. Amen. You tell them folks in, the, in, in, in Jericho, you know, uh -huh. When they was back going to take Jericho back, you know, God gave uh, Joshua a plan. He says, put the praisers in the front. Yeah. Amen. So don't exclude yourself. You know, God has gifted some of us. Mm -hmm. Not me. Not me. God has gifted some of us, but some of us are gifted the same. And you know what we do? We're holding back. We, God is not good enough for us to... For us to sing to him. Oh, Amen. Amen. Maybe one day you'll stand before him. And you say, why didn't you sing? I gave you a gift mm -hmm. to sing. Why didn't you sing to me? What are you going to say? Your friends ain't around. <laughs> Nobody's around except you and him. That's no, I gifted you to sing. Yes. But you wouldn't sing. Mm. Amen. He's gifted us in many different ways. And we are all gifted in many ways. Mm -hmm. Different ways. So we shouldn't have to copy Amen. one another. Yes. Amen. I, I, you know, I couldn't do that. Mm -hmm. I want to, and it sounds good, but when I sing, people run away. <laughs> Amen. So let's be careful. Pray, but I make a joyful noise unto the Lord. And if I'm making a joyful noise unto the Lord, and you happen to be around, you either you bear it or, or just move, move back or go further away. <laughs> Listen to this. Uh, yeah, praise him. Go to the next one. Just, uh, yeah, mag here's another thing. We, we're to praise him, magnify him. Uh, yes, and not that's a problem. good song too. You know, what we do is we always magnify our problems. We're always magnifying anything uh -huh. and everything uh -huh. except him. Yes. Lord, I just want to praise him. I just want to magnify you, Lord. Praise God. Thank you. The greater is he this in me than he this in the world. The Bible says... The temple, this body is the temple of yes. the Holy Ghost. He says, I must go. But if I go, I'm going to send the Holy Spirit yes. to be with you. Amen. So, whatever you're hiding from, it don't matter. He knows. Keep going. Praise Him. Praise Him. 
Let all the people praise him. Yes. Let everything that has breath, breath. Praise, praise the Lord. The Lord. Amen. Amen. If you don't do it now, one day you'll be, <laughs> you'll be right next to him. You know, he'll be right in front of him. Right, and you'll have to praise him. Mm -hmm. And you'll have to bow to him. Yeah. Yes. Keep going. Man, here is why I want it right here. See what the word praise stands uh -huh. for. This is what I got. Okay. Praise means this. It's power released as I submit every day yeah. on a daily basis that's praise praise god you know what lucifer <laughs> but he was a choir or he was a leader of a, a praise and worship in, in heaven until yeah. he got the big head and thought he was <laughs> big and loud you know and god sent him out of that yeah. quick he says like the lightning yes. he was out of heaven quick and he was an archangel was three archangels mm -hmm. and he was one of them but he, he was gone. He's gone. Yes. He's out of there. Yes. And that was Lucifer before he became <laughs> Satan <laughs> or devil. But oh, praise God. is power. Praise is a weapon. Yes. Don't think it, it's a whip thing. Why did he tell Joshua, <laughs> send your praises up front? Joshua, a great general, you know, mm -hmm. hey, I'm a general. I lead my, my armies, you know, mm -hmm. and I know what to do. I put my best soldiers up front. <laughs> God says, put your praises up front. Yeah. 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 So yeah. whatever Lord. he's told you, don't worry about what people are saying. Yeah. Just listen to what God says yeah. and be obedient to what he says. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. It's going to work for you. It may not work for me. I'm going to try to copy that. If I copy it, it ain't going to work for me. No. Because he didn't tell me that. I'm just going to copy what somebody else does. No, no. You know, God didn't make you a copy. Right. God yeah. made you an original. You original. Amen. Yes. <laughs> no one like you. Mm -mm. And you know what? God loves yeah. you more than anything. He knows all about you. He knows all your weaknesses he knows all the bad stuff mm -hmm. but guess what he loves you more than anything yes. you're yes. gonna make me cry praise god. oh Ooh. praise god thank you lord praise god yeah. gratitude gratitude mm -hmm. we have a sign in the back here a uh, picture back there that says gratitude changes everything yes it does gratitude thank you lord you know when you go and before father and you say thank you and you praise him and and, and you appreciate it and, and just with an attitude of gratitude Man, things are going to change. Uh -huh. Father just wants to bless you. Yes, he does. Amen. We're his children. Yes. Guess what he wants to bless? He wants to bless his children. Yes. So, man, don't exclude yourself. Don't yes. run from him. Run to him. Yes. Amen. Yes. Gratitude. A feeling yes. of thankfulness. A feeling of, of, of appreciation. Attitude and acknowledgement of things that he has done. God delights in our attitude. Amen. Uh, God delights in our attitude of gratitude. We're created to praise Him. Man, that's a that's that's a good foundation right there. Amen. Amen. When you start to praise Him, we have some scripture here for you in a few minutes. Keep going, Kirby. Here we go. John 4, 23, 24, King James. And sometimes I've I've shared this with you before, but sometimes I go and check other translations just to make sure. Amen. Just to oh, be yeah. sure. I want you to understand this. It says, but at the hour cometh, uh -huh. and now is when the true worshipers shall yeah. worship the Father in spirit yeah. and in truth. For the Father seeketh such to worship him. Amen. He's looking for us to worship him, you know. Oh, and we goodness. ignore him. Uh -huh. Amen. We just turn ourselves to other things. Mm -hmm. Amen. Right, he's, yeah. look, he's looking for, he's, Father seeks such to worship him yeah. god is a spirit and they that worship him must worship him in spirit yeah. and in truth yeah. amen yeah. man that Lord, blesses, right. blesses me let me yeah. let me see this is the um this is the uh, new living translation it says but the time is coming indeed it's uh -huh. here now when true worshipers will worship the father in spirit and in truth yeah. the father is looking for those who will worship him yes. that way for God is spirit, and those that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. Yes. Keep going. Thank you, Lord. Man, these are good. Bless me all yes. Amen. We won't keep you long. <laughs> First Thessalonians uh, 5, uh, verses 6, uh, 16 through 18. This one says, Rejoice evermore. Pray without ceasing. In everything give thanks. Yes. For this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning yeah, yeah, yeah. who? Uh, you, me, 
Amen. Amen. Personalize it. Make it me. Yeah. And the new uh, this translation here says, "Always be joyful." We've yeah. been talking about joyful. The Bible says, the "Joy of the Lord is your strength." Strength. Amen. Yeah. I don't see myself the way the world sees me. See myself the way the way God sees mm -hmm. me. Amen. When, when you see yourself the way God sees you, yeah. your attitude is going to be totally different. That's Amen. That's Amen. That's Amen. That's the way you want to see yourself. Because I'm not here to please you. Huh. <laughs> I'm not here to please the world. Huh. I'm here to please the Father. All right. Amen. And if he's pleased, I'm pleased, you know. So I don't have to put on a show or entertain or do whatever oh, it is yeah. that the world wants me to do. I'm not going to do that. This uh, living translation says this. It says, Always be joyful. Always keep on praying. Pray without ceasing. Mm -hmm. No matter what happens, always be thankful. Yes. For this is God's will for you. Yes. Who, who belong to Christ Jesus. Uh -huh. Do you belong to him? Have you accepted Jesus? If you haven't, now's the time. Yes, Quit it running. Is. It's yeah. time to stop and say, hey, you know, hey, I, I've been spinning my wheels just like the little hamster we talked about last week mm -hmm. or, or, or on the spinning wheel on that little wheel you know man he's going 100 miles an hour and he's still in the same spot <laughs> <laughs> and you know God has gifted us and, and given us a mission and we're still in the same spot mm -hmm. we fell and we're still down mm -hmm. it's time to get up it's time to dust yourself and say Lord here I am send me Lord yes. and you know what he said you know, he's not going to say, well, you know, I knew, but you know, it's too late now. Forget about it. Mm -mm. No, he don't give up on you. We That's give it. up on ourselves. We quit on ourselves. Mm. Don't quit on him. Yeah. You know, Jesus had opportunities. Mm -hmm. He came. Yes. When before he left heaven, he knew he was going to be sacrificed. Yes, he he still came because he had you in mind. Yes. Amen. He was thinking about you. Yes. He had you in heart. Yes. yes. And you know, every day. When people were not nice to him, people were ugly to him. Mm. And still, he pressed on. Said, yes, Father, I need your strength. Yes. <laughs> we need his strength. And yes, we need him every day. Every day. Amen. Just to keep on going. Just to keep on <laughs> yes. going. You know, if God's on, God are on our side, that's majority. And I'll uh -huh. say, praise God. That's all we need. The crowd could go the other way. But I'm going his way. Amen. Yes. You know why? Because he says he is the only way. Mm -hmm. The truth and life. Nobody goes to the Father except mm -hmm. through him. So I'm going to go his way. Yeah. So some of us have been running too 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 much, okay. too long, and it's time to come home. Time yes. to stop it. Time yeah. to stop. Yeah, stop. You know, hey, stop. Mm. You know, when he went to the cross, he paid for it all. Mm. Yes. So, but we got to know, he says, when you know the truth, it's going to set yes. you free. Set you free. So yes. get the truth in there and keep the truth. Because once yes. you know the truth, it's going to, yes. it's going to totally change you. Mm -hmm. Amen. Keep going. And never be the Hallelujah. This, this people have I formed for myself. Mm. We're talking about for God so loved the world. The world. The world. For God so loved people, mm. right. us, yes. that he gave, he sacrificed his only begotten son. Yes. That whoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting, everlasting life. life. So, you know what? You need to confess with your mouth. Yeah, yeah. And receive him. Yeah. Receive him or reject him. Yes. But you know, one day you'll have to stand before him. Oh yes, you will. Amen. Yeah. One day you'll have to stand before him and, and, and find out why you wouldn't receive him yes. after he yes. sacrificed his only son and Jesus gave himself. Amen. And now you still saying, No, I don't believe this. Or no, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna bow to anything to anyone. Says I have formed you for myself. Yes. You know whether I, as you, mm -hmm. I for myself. Yes. They shall show forth my praise. Isaiah 43 and 21. Right. Amen. Yes. So praise is a good thing. Yes, it is. Right. But you got to praise him. Mm -hmm. Somewhere in here I've got it, but you know, I'll get a little ahead of myself. <laughs> well, I'll, I'll, I'll wait. Some have never been taught about praise and worship. Mm. Amen. You know, if you if you have never been taught, now's the time for you to learn. Oh yeah. Because praise and worship is a great weapon. Mm -hmm. yes. Praise and worship is is a good thing. Is a God yes. thing. Yes. Amen. Yes. Listen, when you don't know praise and worship, you become what you become. Let me see where I wrote it. You become an audience. Yes. 
Mm. Oh, yes. Audiences wants to be entertained. Oh, man. Amen. Audiences want to be entertained. And I've told you this many times. We're not here to be entertained. Yes, We're God's people. You're his church, the body of Christ. Mm. We're here to be empowered. Mm -hmm. Be empowered so yeah, we can yeah. go and do what God wants us to do. That's yes, it. Yes. I mean, you didn't, you 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 weren't sat here just to sit on your nice uh, uh, Yama. <laughs> you were sitting here to do what God wants you to do. He's got a plan for you. He's got a mission for you, and He wants you to fulfill this mission. Yes. Amen. Not just to be comfy and and, and be a, a people pleaser. Amen. <laughs> so, if you don't know praise and worship, you become a spectator. Oh boy. You become an audience. Oh, boy. Amen. Mm -mm. Never <laughs> entertain me. Never please. Mm. Watchers, we become watchers. Mm. We become viewers. We become onlookers. Mm. We become judges. Oh, yes. come on. Amen. Now. Hey, they ain't doing it right. They, yeah, come on. They ain't doing it right. Mm -hmm. You know, they got to do it like this. Mm. Amen. But I'm sitting back and I'm the one that knows it all. Mm. But. I'm just being a judge. Mm -hmm. There's only one judge. That's it. He's gonna you're gonna stand before him one day. Yes. He's gonna he's gonna judge you all right. Yes. <laughs> he says, Hey, you know why you know why I'm not doing this? You know why I'm not doing this? Mm. I'm not I'm not answering because you're not doing it right. Mm. Mm -mm. If you do it right, then won't you do it right and come and show us? Yes. Amen. And and do it. Mm -mm -mm. Don't be ashamed. I'm going to get to it in a few minutes here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they become judges and we sit uncomfy uh -huh. instead of participating, uh -huh. yeah, instead yeah. of joining in. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Amen. Amen. On, you know, when, when your football team <laughs> is playing, mm -hmm. you sit on the stands or you're sitting in your nice little comfy chair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> man, you want to help them out, man. You're rooting for them. <laughs> you're rooting for them. Amen. You come to church, all of a sudden, you're, you're, you're an onlooker, you're an audience, you're, you're a judge. They ain't doing it right, I ain't going to do it, you know. I, I could go and do it right, but they, they don't deserve it, you know. Well, he don't deserve it. We got to get ourselves uh, examined there. So we're not spectators, we become, we should be participators. Part partic participators, we join in. We join in. Amen. We join in. Oh, we yeah. enter in. We partake. Yeah. Yeah. We contribute. Yes. We contribute. Uh, we take part. Yeah. And we chip in. You know when they saw David dancing? He was in his uh his yeah. uh, undergarments, you know. <laughs> and they was talking about him. Uh -huh. And they was they were ticked, yeah. they were ticked off and talking about him because of what he was doing. He, 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 he was praising God. Amen. Don't don't come in your uh, thing, you know. Uh, says, <laughs> listen, I've got scriptures for all this. Keep going, Carmen. <laughs> Here. Expressions of worship. Yes. Amen. So we're going to be talking here. In the, we're going to be talking about singing. Uh -huh. I've got scripture for these. Mm. Okay, we got scriptures. Uh -huh. And shouting and dance. And not oh, only that, God. right below it, it says, it says and all these have scripture. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. So I don't know where you went to church or where, you, <laughs> where you've been, but we got scripture. And you got, you know, somebody tells you to do something. Yeah. And you ask them. Do you have scripture? Uh -huh. He says, oh no, we've always done it like this. Oh, oh yeah. we don't do that. Yeah. Why? Do you have scripture? Oh, no, no, no. We, it's just brother so-and-so or sister so-and-so. Or uh -uh. they say it. We don't do it like that. Oh. It's always been done like this. Don't change it. <laughs> Not even if the word God says so. You better run. <laughs> you better go somewhere else. Amen. <laughs> when we're talking about lifting up our hands, I just read yes. to you. With our hands lifted up yes. and our mouth filled with praise. praise. Yes. Amen. <laughs> with a heart of thanksgiving. I will bless thee, O Lord. With our hands lifted up. Scripture. Yes. Psalms 141.2. We, we, can, we can't go through all these right now. But mm -hmm. another time. Clapping right. up hands. And clapping up hands. Uh, bowing down. Amen. Mm -hmm. All these kneeling. Amen. I didn't put on here laying. Sometimes we just lay oh, before yeah. him, you know. Yes. Thank you, Dancing. Mm -hmm. Amen. 
I bet you there's a whole lot of dancing going on over there last night. Amen. <laughs> Musical instruments, you know, some denomination says, uh, uh, we don't pray, we, we don't play instruments, okay? But it's scriptural. Yes, it is. It's scriptural. Yes. I, I've got scripture for it. Uh -huh. Amen. Let me see what I wrote here. They don't know. They don't know. You know why they don't know? Because they never opened the word. The word. They never <laughs> opened the word of God. They didn't it. And, 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 and read it. No, we just go by what mm -hmm. tradition says. We just yeah. go by the mindsets, you know. It's always been like this. Grandma, <laughs> grandpas, and whatever generations, you know. Mm -hmm. It's always been there like this. We ain't gonna do it. I don't care what the word of God says. <laughs> oh well. Mm. You will. In, oh. in ignorance. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> ignorance God to see. Yes. <laughs> no. Listen, listen, it says they don't know. But it's all scriptural. It's in the Bible. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> here's, why I, here's why I wanted to share with you. I guarantee you. Mm -hmm. Hey, college ball, football is back. Oh, boy. Pro football oh, is back. My okay? Let, I wrote it like this. We do, it, we do it more freely. We do it more freely for the world events than uh, church. Yeah. I yeah. guarantee you. Hey man, hey somebody scored a touchdown. Man, I'm that praising them. So Amen. Yeah. Oh, somebody hit a home run. Praise God. You know? Hey, man, somebody hit a home run. Somebody's jumping up and down, right. clapping, you know. Right. Woo, hallelujah, man. Wow. We do it in those worldly events, but we can't do it in church. Oh no. no. I'm tired. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, too. Oh, I can't do it. I can't do it, Lord. You know, you, you know how I feel, you know. You know how I feel. Man, I just saw you at the game. Man, you were jumping up and down. You was running. You were putting on the show, man. And man, you know what? You were not silent. No. And there was a lot of stuff coming out of you. And then, hallelujah. And you know what? Hey, you know what? I saw you. Man, you ran across the field naked. Woo, <laughs> man. We can do it for the world. We come to church. I hope you don't do it in church. But I saw you running across the field. What's up with this? Woo. Oh my God. And God, and God is, is over there just watching. You know what I'm saying? We do it freely for worldly events. You know, mm -hmm. hey, we go to concerts, you know. Man, oh. that music is good. Man, you know what? Oh, play it more. Play it more, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The clapping, the kneeling, no. the bowing. Man, no. if we can't dance standing up, we dance on our knees. Yeah. Man. <laughs> <laughs> or we'll dance at the table, you know. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Praise God. <laughs> Lift our hands, man. We, we, we just bow down. Man, you guys are great. Man, you guys play great, man. Ooh, hallelujah! You know, you see some of these, some of some of these, uh, what do they call them? Uh, athletes, heroes. You know, they are superstars. You know, people want to just come and touch them and bow down to them. You know, and magnify them. You know, if I was one of them. You know what I'd say? I say, you know what? You need to magnify God. I'm just the person that God gifted me to do these things. And Very God gifted me to do these things, and this is what I do, and I do it because, mm -hmm. you know, this is what I get paid to yes. But I do it to magnify God. I do it because He's my God, mm -hmm. you know. And you want to pray somebody, you want to worship somebody, you worship Him. Mm -hmm. yes. you know, I'm just a man. Mm -hmm. Amen. But it says the Bible tells us that our bodies are the temples of the Holy Spirit. Yes. So yes. we should glorify God in our bodies. Yes. Amen. And uh, 1 Corinthians 6, 19 and through 20, and I wrote it in the easy to read version. It says, you should know that your body is a temple. Yes. For the yes. Holy Spirit that you receive from God lives in you. Yes. Amen. He says, I'll go, but I'll send the Holy Spirit. And you know, no longer you have to go to the temple, that building. Yes. Right. The temple now is your body. Yes. This is the temple of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Mm -hmm. It says, you don't, have, you don't own yourself. Jesus paid the price. Yes, he, he paid a price, you know, that he didn't owe. Mm. Amen. And we owe a price that we cannot pay. We cannot pay. He paid for us. 
Yes. You know, he made a way for us to heaven. Yes. Because we was going straight to him. <laughs> but, 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 but with him, we have a way to heaven. He is the way, the truth, and the life. Nobody goes to the Father except through him. Because yes. he, he he was allowed, he allowed himself to be sacrificed. Uh -huh. He gave himself. He submitted himself to the to his father. Yeah. Amen. Yes. So our body is temple of the Holy Spirit. Yes, it is. You don't own yourself. Mm. God paid a very high price yes, to is. make you oh, his. Right. So honor him with your body. Amen. 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 But abusing Amen. your body, whatever the situation. We're we we've all done different things. Okay, so we just need to stop that. Amen. 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 So praise God. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Lord. Amen. <laughs> We're still praise just God. scratching the surface right yeah. now. <laughs> okay. Some skip. So listen. Some skip. Some <laughs> dissect. Some divide and separate parts of the church service. I don't like that part of service. I don't like that part of service. My favorite part of service is when they say, "Amen." We're done. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Just because you come and sit here don't mean that you're a Christian. Amen. Just because you come sit here don't mean everything's cool until next Sunday. <laughs> or everything's cool until I come sit over here again. No. <laughs> no that's not right, you know. Says some select and choose different denominations. Yeah, you know what? Yes. Hey, this denomination is a little too strict. So I'm going to go to a denomination, one that does not offend me or challenges me. Here's, here's, your, here's, here's your denomination right here. Amen. You read this, it tells you what to do. Denominations got nothing to do with it. Amen. This is the word of God. If they ain't doing it right, I'm going to go by this. So I'm going by what the word of God says. And we're going to do it his way, not people's way. Amen. That's what... Well, I'm not even going to go in there. <laughs> we make it comfy for everybody to come. You know why we make it comfy for everybody to come? Mm -hmm. So we can have more people. So we can have more finances. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why are we doing it? Are, doing, are we doing it under God? Mm -hmm. Are we letting Him just bring Him? Mm -hmm. Or are we just trying to bring it ourselves? Mm -hmm. We got to stop. Yeah, we got to do it under Him. Amen. And we need to take care of the rest. Amen. Amen. When you trust Him. He'll, he knows what to do. Yes, he does. Amen. We're trying to develop new ideas. And how do we entertain this crowd? How do we get more people mm -hmm. in so that we can have the finances we need? Mm -hmm. So that we can, so I can get paid more. Oh, <laughs> you get paid. No, 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 no. No way, Jose, okay? <laughs> Listen to this. Luke 19 and 40. It's here somewhere. There we go. You see them stones? No. Well, Luke 4, 19 and 40 says this in the Amplified. Jesus replied. Jesus said, I tell you, if these people keep silent, says the stones will cry yes. out. Yes. These stones will praise me. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Says, but he says, if they kept kept quiet, the stones would do it for them. Mm -hmm. yes. Shouting praises. Yes. Luke 19 and 40. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. He can do these things. Yep. But you know what? We have a free will. Mm -hmm. We should be free enough to say, Lord, I'm so blessed. And you know, I just want to say thank you. Yes. Amen. Yes. Give thanks with a grateful Great heart. heart. Thank yes. you, Lord. You know, I don't want no stone worshiping my God for me. You know, I'm taking my place. You know what? He's blessed us so much. You know, we're too blessed to be stressed. Yes. If you're stressed, it's because you're not lined up with Him. Amen. You didn't get yourself right with Him. That's it. Amen. Woo. Man, you still love yes. Pastor. Yes. Great. <laughs> Praise and worship. Listen. I've had people say this, so I'm going to say it, okay? Praise and worship is not just a warm-up for the ser for the service. Well, you know, hey, uh, you know, I, you know, when you go, well, I play a lot of sports. And before you play any games, you practice all week. Oh, yeah. And before yeah. any games, you do warm-ups first. Yeah. yeah. Amen. But <laughs> praise and worship is not. A warm up for the service. That's it, that's it. Because I've said this before and I'll say it again. We can go into a praise and worship and stay there. 
Mm -hmm. Amen. He knows what to do. Mm -hmm. And he knows what you need. Yes, not yes. me. He tells me, we, we're going to do this. But if he changes his mind, it's not about me. And I don't just want to say, well, you know, hey, I want my time, you know. Mm -hmm. I like being on camera. I like speaking, you know. And people are seeing me, you know. I got dressed real nice, you know, so people can see me. It's not about me. It's about him. That's it. Amen. I'm just a messenger. Yes. Amen. Yes. But still, <laughs> praise and worship is not just a warm-up for the whole service. Because we can stay in praising him all day. And he'll bless you more than if I brought you a word. Mm -hmm. Amen. So let's let's remember this. We need to enter in. Mm -hmm. Remember we're participators. Yes. Participators mean you're gonna join in. Mm -hmm. You're gonna enter in. Mm -hmm. You know, just say, Well, you know, praise and worship leader was not doing so good, you know. They they need a better praise and worship leader. They need a better choir. They need all kinds of things. Mm -hmm. If we're pleasing people, mm -hmm. yeah, you need all kinds of things. Yeah. But they'll never be pleased. Right. But when you do it under him, yes. he's pleased. We're trying to please him, Amen. not, not Amen. us. Yes. And if you if you if you're still wanting to be pleased, you know what? You need to get off of that and you need to enter in. Yes. 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 You know what you do with your mind is just say blank. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna just enter in mm -hmm. and get in the spirit mm -hmm. and get off the flesh. Yes. Amen. Amen. Yes. Because if you're still in the flesh, <laughs> here's the thing, is you're going to judge, mm -hmm. and it ain't right, it ain't good enough. No, All these things you're going to think of, mm -hmm. instead of saying, you know, I'm just going to partake. And you know, if I have to, I've done this before, is I just close my eyes, mm -hmm. and I lift my hands. Yes. Lord, this is unto you. This is your time. Amen. Yes. And just bless them, you know, instead of talking against the praise team. Or the church, or the pastor, or whatever. Mm -hmm. Pray for them. Amen. I ask, I ask for prayers every time I get up here. I said, pray for me. You know, I didn't say judge me. I said, pray for me. You know, he didn't yeah. do it right. He won't stand it right. He didn't say the right things. Mm -hmm. I'm never perfect. There's only one perfect person. Mm -hmm. They crucified, and then they crucified him. So mm -hmm. you know, he wasn't good enough. And not only that, <laughs> they released. A, a, a killer, mm -hmm. a robber, mm -hmm. instead of Jesus. They, they gave him an option. So who do, who do I believe, Barnabas or, or, or Jesus? He said, Barabbas, Barabbas yeah. excuse me, Barabbas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I said, yeah. what, is, what is up with this? Mm -hmm. This is totally wrong, mm -hmm. you know. So, yeah. hallelujah. You still praise love pastor. Yeah. <laughs> so praise and worship is not just a warm-up for church service. Mm -hmm. Your part is to be involved. Your part is to enter in. Since yes. the, uh, one of Psalms 100 says, I will enter his gates mm -hmm. with thanksgiving into his courts with praise. Right. I, 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 I will enter in. Yes. Amen. Right. So let's let's remember this. Amen. Thank you, Lord. We invite him to join us. Yes. You know, mm -hmm. he's here to stay the whole the whole service the whole time he's here. Yes. Yes. And the works. Uh, daily also. Mm -hmm. He visits with us daily. Invite him to join you on a daily basis as you go out. You know, yeah. Spend time with him. And he says he, he'll never leave you nor forsake you. Mm -hmm. He's always with you wherever yeah. you go. Amen. Mm -hmm. He comes when he's invited. He comes to stay. Yes. So we need to stay connected with him. Amen. Revelations 3 and 20 should have. There we go. Revelation 3 and 20 says, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any, if anyone, that's yes. you, that's me. If yes. anyone, Amen. scratch that and put Jose. Mm -hmm. Says, if anyone hears my voice yes. and opens the door, uh -huh. I will come in to him and dine with him yep. and he with me. Yes. What do I have to do? Mm -hmm. I have to be in tune with him. Yes. But I, I have to open. Mm -hmm. You know, how many of us know? Somebody send me a friend request and say, confirm or deny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do I do? Man, you have a choice. Yeah. And Jesus is knocking. Are you going to confirm mm -hmm. or are you going to deny? Mm -hmm. If you don't open, you're denying it. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't want you. Mm -hmm. Go away. Mm -hmm. Not now. I'll call you when I need to. Oh, Jesus. Come on now. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. He knows. But he's not going. 
you know, uh, getting a little ahead of myself, but the prodigal son, he says, Dad, give me my stuff. I'm yeah. going to go. I got to go here. do my own thing. I'm out of yeah. here. Adios. But you know, he is gone doing his thing. Mm -hmm. But the father says, the father went out every day mm -hmm. and looked down the road waiting mm -hmm. for his son to come back. Mm -hmm. God is looking for you to come home. Oh, On a daily basis, he wants you to come home. Mm -hmm. Amen. So, some of you listening, some of you watching, mm -hmm. quit running. It's time yes. to come home. Yes. You know? It's time to come home. Why yeah. father's, father's waiting? Father sacrificed his son. Jesus <laughs> died. He was buried in his rose and he went there, he rose to heaven. But he sent our seed for us and he gave his best, so we need to give our best. We need yeah. to come home and say, Lord, what is it you want me to do? Okay. What is it you want me to do? Yes. Yep. Praise God. We're not going to finish this. We're not going to try. But uh, look, I stand at the door and knock. New Living Translation says, look, I stand at the door and knock. If you hear my voice and open the door, I will come in mm -hmm. and we will share a meal together as friends. Mm -hmm. But you have to do something. Yes. Your part is to open up. Mm -hmm. You know, it's very simple. Mm -hmm. The Bible says, that if we confess with our mouth uh -huh. our Lord Jesus and believe in our heart, we will be saved. But right. what if we confess, I have something to do. That means I have to confirm, I have to receive it or reject it. Yeah. Either way, we'll see him at the end. Yeah. But I wanted to say, welcome home, good and faithful servant, instead yeah. of saying, depart from me. I never knew you. Mm -hmm. I don't want that. Amen. And oh. you don't you don't want that. He comes daily. On service time, he comes daily at work times, all the times. He knocks and he wants to visit. We need to open up. Do we welcome him or do we reject him? If we open and make ourselves available, he will come in. If we reject him, we can't complain about him never visiting us. Yeah, amen. Amen. We can't complain. Say, well, he never sees me. You know, hey, I'm a nobody. The world says I'm no good. The world says I'm a nobody. So... You know, uh, mm -hmm. forget it. You know, mm -hmm. you you depending on the world and not on Him. Yes, he yes. only comes in when we open the door uh -huh. and invite Him in. His door is always open, and that's yes. I was talking about the prodigal son. His door is always open. He's waiting for the prodigal son. He's waiting for the son to come home. Jesus yes. came home. Yes. He went and did what he did, but he came back home. He went back to the Father. He did what he did, but he went back to the Father. And you know, the, the son tried to disqualify himself and tell the Father why he shouldn't treat him good and bless him anymore. He said, well, you can pay me just like a, a, a servant. The Father says, bring this, bring this, bless him with this, put this on him, you know, kill the fatted calf. Yeah. Amen. He says, you are who he created you to be and you're an original so see yourself the way he sees you Amen. don't see yourself and don't compare yourself to anyone else see you see yourself the way god sees you mm -hmm. and uh close with this hebrews 4 16 says this let us therefore come boldly to the throne of grace that we may obtain mercy and find grace to help mm -hmm. in time of need amen right, yeah. so praise god amen Thank you. We'll stop. We'll stop right there. Did you receive? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hallelujah. Me too. <laughs> Some of you watching, you know, listening. You know you've been running, and it's time to stop. Yeah. You know, just like the prodigal son, it's time to come home. And Father's waiting for you to come. And Father's waiting for you to fulfill the mission He's given you. He qualified you, so don't disqualify yourself, and don't let the world disqualify you. He. You're down and out because you haven't been obedient to the Father. So it's time to come home. All you have to do is say, Lord, I've sinned against you. I repent. Come in my life. Be my Lord and Savior. And you know what? He's going to take you back. And He's going to bless you and send you out. He's called to you. He's equipped you. And He's anointed you. Yes. So all you have to do is, is just be in tune, submit, commit, and go with Him. Amen. So let's remember that. If you have sickness in your body, he's not giving us uh, a spirit of sickness. Amen. 
So malfunctions happening in your body, just say, I reject all sickness. By Jesus Christ, I am healed. So body, body, I'm speaking in my body. Body be healed. Receive your healing right now in Jesus' name. So I rebuke, I command all sickness, all malfunctions to stop in this body. And I release the healing powers of Jesus to overtake me right now in Jesus' yes. name. My body will function the way God created to function. Yes. Amen. And there's no malfunctions and there's no imperfections. Okay. So we call it well, we call it heal in Jesus' name. Amen. And it's time to heal. Amen. So on the Praise chapter God. screen, <clears throat> you can go to our website, nbcbigben.com. Hit that donate button. If you're mailing it, NBC PO Box 252 Marfa, Texas 79843. And Cash App. New Beginnings Church of the Big Ben. God loves you and we love you. Praise God. Thank you. Are we off, Jesse? No. Oh, go, go ahead, turn it off. Okay, we go. Uh-huh. <laughs> Very much.